it's the latest fitness craze that has had all the celebrities jumping for joy. Well, today we're following in the footsteps of Jennifer Aniston and Taylor Swift with the world's top trampoline cardio instructor, and it's Simone Delarue. And good morning Hi. and welcome. Good morning, good morning. Can you start off in sort of Broadway in the West End? Yes, yes. So I was a professional dancer for about 18 years on the West End yeah. and Broadway, but then I segued into fitness. Right. And so, and so it, incorporating dance into, uh, into your um, body by Simone. Yes. It's about 2011, and that's become an empire now. Well, thank you. Um, I always loved to dance, but I haven't really loved the traditional gym, and I know a lot of women feel the same way. So well, I wanted because... to create a fun and joyous workout that was effective, but also you'd have a great time doing it. Yeah. Because you've kind of got that sort of hit classes, and sometimes they can be quite aggressive with lots of people shouting at you and sometimes we don't really like that. No, I mean, you're never going to find me saying, drop and give me 20. Right. So I, I'm known for being nurturing and loving and I think women respond to that. So where does the trampoline come into it? Well, I'm glad you asked because this is honestly a fabulous workout. It's small, you can have it in your house, you can have it under your bed. Um, there's so many health benefits to it. So it drains the lymphatic glands, it helps boost your immune system. If you have any knee or hip or back injuries, it's a wonderful way to get your heart rate up, burn calories, but it's low impact because of the mat is so soft. Well, you'd be thinking jumping would, have, would be bad for your knees, but not, but not, not the case. But not on this trampoline. So this is a wonderful way to, you know, take care of your heart health mm. and doing it in a fun way and as the, well. And the celebs are interested as well. Well, everybody loves it. Everybody wants to have an exercise that's effective and that you yeah. can really see change in your body. But look, I, I, I don't want to work out. I don't know about you ladies. So then this is actually, like, it makes you smile. There's something about it that makes you connect with your inner child. Sandra Bullock, Taylor Swift. Rosie Huntington Whiteley, Reese Witherspoon, um, Jan Anderson, all all into trampolining. Yes. <laughs> <laughs> um, so there's, I mean, lots of people are going, oh, January, new January, new year, mm -hmm. new you, and that's not something you really abide by. You like to think no. slightly differently. Yeah, because we have to be very careful of the language that you we're using, right? It's still the same you. Yeah. It's a new year, but it's new goals and it's new dreams. So we don't want to change the person that we are. We want to celebrate who we are. So therefore, you've got some January tips for us. Yep. So short-term goals, that's part of the key here. Mm -hmm. You don't want to say, oh, I'm going to work out um, every day, you know, 12, 12 um, classes a week and, you know, give up sugar, give up gluten, give up caffeine, mm. give up fun, all in your first week on January 1st. Because yeah. you're going to, you know, that sets you up for failure. And that's mm. the first one. So you say set, because you, you've got set, keep, find. Yes, set realistic goals and attainable goals. When you get to that goal, you can be, well done me, tick, gold star, and then you can set the next goal. Right. Okay. Otherwise, it's, you know, there's... there's it's, a room for failure. Yeah, you don't no, that want makes that. sense. Yeah. Um, and keep, then keep a food and workout journal. Yeah, it keeps you accountable because that way, like, you think, oh, did I actually? What did I eat today? Just had a croissant, but don't tell anybody in the green yeah. room. Yeah, but if you actually write it down and see what you've eaten, then you can say, judge for the next day. Okay, that wasn't a great choice. Perhaps I'll change it for tomorrow. Find. Okay. Find. Your last one. Set. Keep. Find. So you've got it's a workout buddy. Someone find a workout work buddy. Well, yeah. Find a workout buddy. Exactly. You if you've got your someone own three with things, you, then, I know. You? I was like, find what? Well, what am I finding? My mind. <laughs> <laughs> so find a workout yeah, buddy. Yeah, find a workout buddy because they're going to keep you accountable. If you're in bed, you're not going to want to get up out of bed. Right, but if okay. you know that there's someone there waiting for you, yeah, you know, you're more fun to, to do there. it with someone. Um, so exercises. You're going to demonstrate some of these now, aren't you? So yes. jump squat is the first one. Jump squat. So ladies, we're going to show this. So this is a wonderful exercise. It's working the quad. The hamstring and the glutes, which are the largest muscle groups in the body, so it's going to kick our heart rate up. So you can imagine that you're sitting on a chair, putting your booty all the way back, and you're going to fly up to the ceiling, up, jump, and down. So the key is you want to try and keep your legs straight in the air and you're landing on bent knees. This is right. working your stability, your core, your balance. But if you do three sets of 10 reps of this, immediately you're going to find that your heart rate is... Heart rate goes up. And what, what, yeah. uh, what muscles are you uh, going to benefit here? So that's so the be, that's quad, thighs, hamstring yeah, and the glutes. And your, and your butt. Yeah. yeah. OK, and the next one is a sprint. A sprint. So let's run, ladies, as fast as you can. Now, this looks easy, but this actually feels like you're running in quicksand. OK. Now, there's a recent study by NASA that says 10 minutes of rebounding is far more beneficial for your cardiovascular health than if you did 30 minutes of jogging. Oh, really? And I don't know about you, but I'm recently a new mum and I don't have time to work out. So 10 minutes to me to know that I can get a great workout in in 10 minutes. Yeah. 
words. Mm. It's like, yes, and again, please, let's do this. And again, that's not sort of pounding the pavement no. with regards go to the knees. Go, let's go! Go, 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 go. <laughs> All right, I'm going to save you, girls. Stop. Uh, exercise three <laughs> is well knee tucks. Knee tucks. So this one's working our lower abs, so you're going to keep your arms up. You're going to do three little jumps, and then you bring your knees tuck in. One, two, three three and in. Yeah, and then rebounding, it's not like when you were a child and you used to jump. Yeah, right. You have to like really push into the trampoline and rebound into it. So it's actually an incredible core cool workout because you have to stabilise so that you don't fall off. Now, you just said there you're a new mum. Yes. A lot of new mums will be watching this going, if I got on that trampoline, I would wet myself. Pee myself? Yes. Yeah. So... Well, why do you think I've got black leggings on? <laughs> <laughs> so is it just like, go for it, no one it cares? I mean, yeah, <laughs> it, it happens. And I, I always used to ask, because I used to wear bright colours before I was a mum, and I'd say, why are you wearing black? And they would say, I've had children, and I pee myself. So now I understand oh, to wear black leggings, everybody. Right, OK. Yeah? So it happens. Well, it's got to make that quite slippy, isn't it? Oh, no, you've got to be careful. It. That's why we practice our pelvic floor so, exercises. But can it help improve that? And um, well, you you may no, be, you're all dead. Before <laughs> exercises can definitely help. Okay. Where um where and how much are, are these? Where do you these get them from? These are um, jump sport trampolines. There are a few different brands that you can get, but these are my favourite. I love them because the mat is so soft. Mm. Is you don't have those old fashioned springs where you hear. Yeah. Um, uh, you can get these. I think they're about three hundred dollars on Amazon. Right. And if okay. uh, and if you've got high ceilings in your house, could you jump on the bed? Um, <laughs> yes. <laughs> right. The final exercise. We should just finish them off. Side kicks. Side kicks. Yep. Yeah. Keep your feet together. You're going to kick out to the side and oh. drop down and kick out. Yes. Look out because I might kick you kicking down. And then Phil, do you want to demonstrate one? Well, Come on, I, I mean, think you'd look incredible. I've got... Uh, <laughs> black trousers on, you're no, fine. Sure. Yeah, your black trousers, you're got fine. got black trousers yeah. and boots, OK. Try right, run, so... try, try the sprint. OK. Yes, run, 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 get those knees up and swing those arms. How's that, Phil? Swing your little legs. Yeah. See? Look at my little legs. You're, you're working little your legs. Twiggly legs. You're getting your so heart rate up. Oh, yeah, oh, oh, yeah, oh, yeah, oh, yeah, oh, yeah. Oh, that's fine, that's fine. I'm a Pilates king. Yeah, exactly. Now, how do you feel? Yeah, good. Yeah, see, so it's like the heart rate is up and it's soft on the joints. And when you're not using it, it's a bit of equipment the kids are Yeah, we can just chuck well, it under so. the bed. No one will um, know. Thank you. Thank, thank you very thank much. You thank you for having us as well. Thank Yay, you. Thank, thank you, ladies. You.